Hi, Doug West here, director of the Tone Lab at Mesa Boogie in Petaluma, California. We're here with our friends from Guitar Center, and we're going to take a look at the Fillmore series of amplifiers, and we're going to start with the Fillmore 50, the middle of the road. We've been making Fillmores for about five years now, and they actually began as a California tweed. But we early on saw an opportunity to expand the whole tweed architecture far beyond what the California tweed concept would offer. First, we saw an opportunity to split it into three modes, a clean mode for clean rhythm, a drive mode for the in-between sounds, and a high mode for the more gainy sounds for soloing and dirty rhythm. That enabled us to have two channels so that you could switch between any of those modes and have foot switching. So what we wanted for the clean was to have a little bit cleaner uh, sound and a little more headroom than your normal tweed amp. Go a little bit higher on the gain control before it started clipping. In the drive mode, we wanted it to start out low, be able to be used for cording, and then go on up to almost a crunch rhythm, or at least a traditional kind of crunchy rhythm. And then in high, we wanted to have more focus, more compression, and a little more liquid feel, so it could be used across the board for anything from heavy rhythms all the way to soloing. Though the three modes range across a wide spectrum of gain, they all share the same DNA. So even though the clean and the drive are brighter, we actually wanted to go a little bit darker and more compressed in high so that it could be used for anything from crunch rhythm all the way to pretty soaring lead sounds. So let's hear the three modes with the humbucker. Like all tweed circuits, the Fillmore uses a tone stack that comes farther down the signal path near the end. This means you can set the treble a little lower for warmer sounds and the bass and mids a little higher because they will stay tighter being at the end of the signal chain. So this is really different than our Mark amps, which tend to see the treble control higher, maybe the bass and mids a lot lower. The fitting of a vintage inspired amp, each channel has a reverb control, so you can get just the right amount of drench reverb for any sound you're dialing. So let's go back to the clean mode and listen to three different settings of the reverb, one that's mild, one that's medium, and one that's fully drenched. The Fillmores are available in three different models. The 25 watt that uses six V6s, the 50 watt, which we've shown you here, that uses six L6s, it switches from 50 down to 25, and the 100 watt that also uses six L6s that gives you full, half, and low, which is basically 100 watts, 50 watts, and 20 watts. Between these three models, you should be able to find the perfect Fillmore for your needs. <laughs> To learn more about the whole Fillmore line, visit your local GC, call one of their expert gear advisors, or go to guitarcenter.com. You know you're going to love the Fillmore.